Telling yes. you about. Yeah. Hey, my daughter has told me a lot of good things about you. You're welcome. Hmm? Sit down. Make yourself comfortable. I'm coming. Let me go and bring you. Would you make it? Mama. I do go. Mama. Sit with him, eh? Oh, no more. Nah. Make yourself comfortable. Oh. Hey! No. Hey, Are you okay? Yeah. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm not fine. Okay. You, eh? You didn't even ask me what I've been telling my mom about you. <laughs> oh. <laughs> big man, big man, beautiful big man. It's surprising how everyone in this village thinks that you're no so's father. Including my mother. But I won't blame them because you act like you are. <laughs> See, let me tell you. I don't care what people say. Hmm? What you call me is Azwan Okawan of Nobodai. I don't care what people say, they can say whatever they like. It will not affect the way I feel about this beautiful boy. Hmm? See, let me tell you. I could remember the way the day your mother came here, dragging you, said that I, uh, you are my goose or I have a chest. I didn't care. Let them say, as far as it will not make anybody to call this boy bastard. I said, Mkuchri. I don't even want to think about what happened that day. I went through the most difficult time of my pregnancy. See, Amara. Mm? You are my friend. And uh, I have been telling you secret of mine. Everything that is secret about me, I've been telling you. Is it not time for you to tell me the, who is the father of this boy? Hmm? Let me at least let me know you, you, my problem. My problem is that. But you have been hiding it from me. If there's anybody in this world that's supposed to know what is going on, who is the father of this boy, and any who, who, who in your life, I should be the one. Are you are hiding it from me. And people are accusing me. I don't care. I let them accuse me. Hmm? I am um, in the BC. I'm sorry I put you through all of this. If I have my way, I would wish for you to be Nonso's father. Mm -mm, mm -mm. Because you're a good person. See, wishes has passed. If wishes are horses, Vokanasas like me will ride horse. Do you understand? So that those times have passed. You don't have to remember it. I, I, I don't want to talk about anything about it. I don't even want to remember it. When the time is right, I will tell you. Hmm? I, I have to go now. I will see you some other time. Let me have you. Uh -uh, uh -uh, uh -uh. Are you angry? I'm not. I just, I just have to go. Sir. Because you are living in apart for me. me oh, I will see you some other time. Please. Amara. I will see you some other time. Amara, are you angry because of what I said? Everybody was accusing me because I, I, uh, they said I impregnated you. Is that right? I will think up. Mm -hmm. It's like I will, I will find my way. Amara. Just like, like that, she's going. Amara, I'm going to pant here. I'm going to wear panty green now, madam. I'm going to wear panty red. I'm going to wear brazy. I don't know. People are accusing me. I took it. I'm going to have hiding things from me. <laughs> Let me go and give this plate. Oh, hey. <laughs> Mama. Thank you, Mama. How is the food? Oh, very well. <laughs> Very Mama, nice. <clears throat> Tony has something to tell you. Tony, what do you want to tell me? <laughs> Talk. Uh, Mama, the thing is, uh, 
you have such a wonderful family. Uh, I must say the hospitality is really, really top notch. So your daughter and I have known each other for for some months now. You know, she's a very good girl. No doubt you you brought up a kind and hardworking woman. So I have come to, you know, do the right thing. I have come to formalize this relationship. I want to marry her. Ah, my son, this is a good news. Mm -hmm. The desire of every woman is to see their female children get married. Um, but I'm sure both of you discussed this and come up with this decision. Right, Mama. <laughs> both of us agreed <laughs> to it. <laughs> and that's why we came together. And I really do love him. <laughs> then you have my consent. Hundred percent. Thank you, Mama. Thank you. I love them so much. It's okay. My baby sister. You? What are you doing here? Amara. Amara, what has come over you? What's come over you? Why? This man is a beast. Amara. He's a demon. He has no conscience. Amara. Amara, what is your problem? What is your problem, Amara? Do you both know each other? Do you know her? Amara, come back here. Amara! Amara! Amara, what happened between you two? Huh? Who is he to you? Amara, answer me, I'm talking to you. Who is he? Do you know him? <laughs> What is so difficult for you to say? Answer me, I'm talking to you. Who is he to you? Do you know him? Yes. And what happened? What is so difficult for you to, to talk? What is so difficult for you to say? Talk to me. I am your mother. Amarachuku. I am your mother. Talk to me. What happened between you two? Do you know my sister? Yeah. She, she was my domestic staff. So? What about that? Why would she speak to you in that manner? Why would she rude to you? Yes, you were once her boss. So what? Why would she speak to you in that manner? Amara! 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 Amara, what was the meaning of that? I am talking to you. What was the meaning of that? Why would you speak to Tony in that manner? He is my fiancé. Do you want to know? Oh yes, I want to know. You really want to know? Yes! Yes! That beast! That bloody animal! That demon! Hey, 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 hey! Hold it right there. That man in there is my fiancé. So stop with the name calling. He's not so father! I am an You 
for nothing but a liar. Liar! That's what you are. That's who you are. You are a liar. I'm saying the truth. He's not so father. He forced himself on me. <laughs> Taking at this long. He usually doesn't stay out. I just hope he's not in trouble. Sneaking as if he be thief, I'm like, you a thief? Um, what did they say about the other bag? Oga asked me to bring this back to him, so I, I just want to go to the junction and, and, and give him the bag. Oga who? I'm like, are you sure? Wait, I don't even understand. Why are you even asking me questions? See, I will tell Oga you're the one delaying you. You know what he will do I want to see that bag. I want to know what's in inside that bag. You want to see what is as what? Look at this stupid gate. Amara! Amara! If you like, don't lock the gate. Amara! You better lock the gate. And they suspend this gear for this compound. And they suspend this gear. So no problem. Okay, no problem. This is your and waka waka in the waka for this compound. I go see him. No problem. I left because I was ashamed. I felt so dirty and used. I couldn't imagine myself waking up every day to behold the face of the man. That took my virginity away from me. Hey! 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 Sorry. I didn't know when it happened. I was drunk that night. But I searched everywhere for her. I searched everywhere. So I can apologize for what I did. But there was nowhere to find her. I didn't know what came over me. You are sorry. You raped my sister! Tony! I'm not proud of my actions. I'm ready to do anything. I'm ready to do anything for her to make up for it. 
And what about your son? Um, like I said, we will do our best to stop the bleeding. And um, by God's grace, she will be fine. Just that um, she may not be able to conceive again. The effect of the drug she took during her first pregnancy affected her womb. Are you joking? Um, wait a minute. Doctor, do you mean she will never conceive and give birth to her own child? What? I can't leave her. I can't. I love her. Love doesn't count here. Eh? It's your future we are talking about. And that of the family. Mama, how could you be so callous? Have you forgotten? I am responsible for that girl's predicament. I made her lose her womb. How can you tell me not to marry her? After everything she went through? I'm really I'm not asking you to leave her. Then what are you saying? If you love her that much, you can keep her as your mistress. But get a woman that will give you children. Mama, can you, can you listen you to yourself? Do you want your father's lineage to close? How can my father's lineage close? This is a jet age, mama. This is a new modern age. We can get pregnant. There are ways, different ways to get pregnant. Different ways. We can even adopt. I forbid you. You will never do such thing. Not while I'm still alive. Mama. Mama, please. Can you, can you reason? It's obvious you're not going to listen to me. And I'm not going to talk about this again. I'm tired. Really? And I will never accept that witch as my daughter in love. That's fine now. Oh, you want to run? You want to run as usual, right? You go ahead and run. But let me tell you, you can never run away from the truth. My children, what has happened, has happened. What are we going to do? What is the way forward now? Mama, hmm? I will never forgive that man for what he did to me. I don't think I will ever do. Amara. Amara Chuku. What the young man is asking for is your sister's hand in marriage. What do you want us to Mama, do? Mama, I do not care. She can go ahead and marry that beast if she so wish. But I would never change my mind on this. 
I would never forgive him. Amara, you have nothing will make me to change my mind on this. If you so desire of him, if your body is itching so much to be with him, you can go oh. ahead and marry him. But I will never change my mind on this. Mama, let me have my son. Amara, easy. Easy with it, baby, now. so worried. These days I barely sleep. I've been thinking a whole lot. Um, okay. Just relax, okay? Let me go get you a cup of tea to cool your nerves. Mama, that is not what I need. What is it? Do you remember my domestic staff that I told you left a few months ago? Mm -hmm. What about her? She had a baby for me. Is it Hey! Mama, please, no, not now, okay? I'm, I'm confused. What is confusing you? Anthony, this is good news. She's Ujuma's younger sister. And so? And so? Listen, we are going to pay her bride price right away. No wasting time. Please, our blood cannot stay outside. Pay whose bride price? Her bride price, of course. She's Ujunwa's younger sister, Mama. What about Ujunwa? Ujunwa. Are you so blind to see the handwriting boldly written on the wall? Can't you see God doesn't want you to marry Ujunwa, but her sister instead? Hmm. It's so clear. Oh, Anthony. You should be happy. Come on, you know what that means. You have a baby. I don't know what to do. Lord, please come to my aid. I need sorrow. Lord, please come to my aid. My life is shambles. Lord, please come to my aid. I'm crying there. I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Please come to my aid. I'm in sorrow. Lord, please come to my aid. My life is shambles. Lord, please come to my aid. I am crying. Lord, please come to my aid. What have I done to deserve this? My sister said. She fell to destroy me. Why? I can't believe this is happening to me. I am not an object of laughter. To know I just want us to think about this again. I don't have a problem with it. As a matter of fact, I am very happy. Children are gift from God. I don't understand why you don't want us to do this. We are adults and I'm going to be here for you. Yes, I agree with you. We are adults. But try.
try and understand. This is no longer about you and I. I don't understand what you mean. If I'm responsible for the pregnancy, then it's about you and I. Babe, it is about my mother. This pregnancy will kill her. My younger sister just had a child outside wedlock. And now this? Hell no. Please, let me get rid of this one. Please. Babe, you are not your younger sister. The man that is responsible for the pregnancy is telling you here that he is with you. And I'm going to marry you. Then let's get married. First things first, let's get married. But you see this one? I can't keep it. I, I, I don't want my mother to go through the same ordeal. Please. Taking it out doesn't mean that I don't love you. Of course you know I love you. But I can't keep this one. I have to save my mother's face. My mother is a member of the CWO. I don't want to put her to shame. Please, let me take out this one. Maybe that is a sin. I know, but we need to do the right thing. We need to follow the due process, and that is getting married first before pregnancy. Allow me do this one. I still love you. <laughs> ah, fine, fine. It's okay. Good to see you. Mama, you've seen now. Uh, you've seen it. It's not been really easy. Uh -uh. I was even. Uh, Mama? Yeah. How are you? Good afternoon, ma. Good afternoon, my daughter. Please sit. Thank you. Anthony, who is this beautiful girl? I was going to bring her to your place, but now that both of you have met, let me do the introduction. Her name is Ujumwa. Ujumwa. That's my name. Hmm, beautiful name. Thank you, Ma. So, tell me, where are you from? Um, She's from our neighboring village. Oh, really? Yes, Ma. So close. Ah, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, Ma. You're welcome. Thank you. So, Ujuma, my mother. I know. I'm sure you've heard us. Uh, of course. We're nobody for you. <laughs> See, don't mind him. We argue because he's a very stubborn boy. He refused to do what I asked him to do. Oh, Mama, I always say, give me the right time. Give me the right time. Anthony, time waits for nobody. There is no right time in marriage. That is it. You think you're still a child? Age is no longer on your side. Though. Mama, please, l um, let me quickly make something for you to eat. Okay? It's fine. Excuse me. Wow! Tony, she's a nice girl, you know. I don't want. She's the one. Thank God I'm here. <laughs> Uduma. Yes, ma. Well done. Thank you, ma. I can see you're really taking care of Anthony. No wonder I've not seen him in two weekends now. Ma, apologies. I didn't mean to keep him away from you. <laughs> Not to worry. <laughs> I'm just joking with you. <laughs> um, I can see both of you are in love with each other. Because I've never heard Tony talk about any other woman the way he did about you. I agree, ma. We love each other. 
Tony is a good man. Ma, I must commend you for raising a good man. Thank you very much. And that's why I'm here. So now tell me, what is the delay? I mean, what is stopping you from settling down? You're a beautiful girl in love with my son. So why not persuade him? If possible, get pregnant. Oh yes, you have my support. And trust me, I'll make him to marry you. Tell me, is there anything I need to know? No, feel free. No, ma. Are you sure? Yes, ma. Okay, let's be hopeful. Thank you, ma. Thank you. You're welcome. Baby. Mama is right. I mean, we love ourselves. Your business is flourishing. What are we waiting for? Can't we just get married? I'm, uh, You've been talking to Mama. Yes. And. Is anything wrong with that? But then she's right. What are we waiting for to formalize it? Our relationship. But baby, we have talked about this the last time. We have agreed to see your mother. Let's go on our own pace. Please. Do not be a cute joy. Just guess. Uh, babe, you know I'm not really disposed for. Okay, that's okay. That's fine. That's fine. I'll just have to let the cat out of the bag. <laughs> Ta da! I'm really excited. Mm -hmm. Just making. This hospital. Yes, it is. You're pregnant again? Yes, I am. Oh my god. <laughs> you want and it shall be given up to you <laughs> okay fine first things first okay. why don't we go see my mother and proceed with the marriage rights that we must do your lordship
Your uncles have a hand in this. They don't want me to carry my grandchild. I don't know why they are working so hard to destroy everything your late father labored for for the past 38 years. Mama, please, this is hospital. Please, this is not the right time for this. Would you life might be in danger in there? That is what I'm thinking here. Well, we're saying the same thing. It's just that you're blind from seeing the truth. Hey, those men are not to be trusted. Please calm down. The doctor is attending to her. He will soon be here to address you. I know, but I need the baby. Will the baby survive? Excuse me, ma'am. What is wrong with all these nurses? All these nurses here, why are they behaving the same? They're so frustrated. Simple question. That oh, this is a simple no, answer. Oh, mama, can I think? You're adding to my problem. I'm stressed. I'm stressed too. We're in the same condition. Hey, my grandchild. Oh, my love, it's okay. It's okay. This is not the end. We can still have as much babies as we want. Okay? We are still young. Please. Ujumwa, how could you? How could you be so careless around the house? Mama, Mama, please. This is not the right time to do please. this. Please! If she had not slipped, my grandchild would have still been alive now. Mama, stop this thing now. So what do you want her to do now? She was careless. She was! Can you stop? Stop what? Can you stop? Anyway, I can't sit here and watch the face of a woman that killed my first grandchild. I can't stand Mama, it. Please, you, you can't. Just go. Just go. Just go, please. Go. Ah. I don't know if you're trying to pour petrol into fire or what. Mm. Okay. Um, I'm sorry. Mm. Okay. Mr. Tony, the doctor would like to see you in his office. Yeah. Okay. Come. I need to see the doctor. I'll be right back, okay? Okay, um, like I said, we will do our best to stop the bleeding. And um, by God's grace, she will be fine. Just that um, she may not be able to conceive again. The effect of the drug she took during her first pregnancy affected her womb. Are you joking? Um, wait a minute. Doctor, do you mean she will never conceive and give birth to her own child? <sighs> exactly. What? So sad. It, hey. It's just going to. Hey, baby. Please. Don't lie to me. Don't hide anything from me. I, I, am I going to die? No. 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 But you'll never be able to have a child. Mama. What is Mama? No, what is Mama? What is wrong with you? How do you mean? Hey, no. Is it true? No, no, no. Is it? No, she, she's it lying. She, she's lying, my life. <laughs> but that's not lying. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. That is what you get for being so careless. How could you? 
Who were you thinking? A superwoman or wonder woman or what? Eh? Now listen. I will not allow you to ruin my son's life with your damaged womb. Mama. What is mama? I would have to ask you to leave now. There won't be need for that. Because I'm already leaving. Please. And that's for you, Ujumra. Stay away from Anthony. I suffered so much. You want to push me out? Just leave, just leave, just leave, please. I will not be alive and watch him marry you. Trust me on that. Please leave, leave. And you. Leave, Mama, leave, leave. Leave. Tend to be like this. Eh? I've told you, if Tony truly loves you, he must come back for you. Eh? Stop this. Ada. What, what about Amaran Nonso? What about them? I have invited your uncles to come and put mouths in this. As you can see, this is a delicate issue. Eh? Bikun, stop. Would you please talk to me? Is there something else bothering you apart from this? Because I've not seen you like this. Talk to me. I am your mother. Fine. No, you are not fine. You are not fine. This is not you, Juma. Talk to me. Are you hiding anything? Is there anything I'm supposed to know? Talk to me. Are you pregnant? No. I'm, I'm fine. You are not. Fine, Mama. You. you are not fine, Mom. You are not fine, Mom. Huh? Eh? Jesus. Um, my name is Ezika. And this is Mado, my brother. May we know why you are here. Okay. Thank you very much. I am Anthony's mother. My son told me that one of your daughters had a son for him. That's why we are here. Um, you don't understand what you're saying. You see, we have a tradition. And according to the tradition of this land, every child born in this house belongs to the family. You can't accuse us of having your child. You and your son are in the wrong place. Please. We are peace-loving people. We are not here to argue nor claim rights. No, not at all. That is exactly what you have just done. How dare you accuse us of having your grandson? Um, Chi, 
Biko. I hasn't got into that. As my mother said earlier, we are peace-loving people. And we are gathered here because we want peace. Okay? So forgive the choice of a word she, she used. It's just that um, we just want us to settle this amicably so that everyone will be happy. We are not troublesome. We just want us to have that understanding and then we all we agree and the rest follows. Okay? Please. The only way you can have your son is to get married to the mother. You can't defile one and expect to marry another. After all, they are both our daughters. Okay? Yes. Um, cheers. I'm not trying to be selfish, okay? I'm not just um, here to talk about marrying the sister alone and leaving her just like that. I have decided to start up a business or anything of her choice. If she wants to go to school anywhere, abroad anywhere, I will take care of it. If she wants to do business, any choice of business, I will do it. But getting married to her is what I can't really do. Okay? Njunwa is the one I want to marry. She's the person I love. Just anything to make her happy, anything of her choice. Let her name it here and now, and it will be granted. But the marriage part, let's, let's, just, um, let's just stick it out. Be cool. My sister's pet red is getting worse day by day. I don't know what to do. Lord, please come to my aid. My sister's pet red is getting worse day by day. I don't know what to do. Please come to my bed. My life is shambled. Please come to me. Come back here. Come back here, Amarachi. Oh, Amarachi. Listen to me. You can't go on with so much anger in you. You must let go. I have to let go. I have to let go because you want him to marry your favorite daughter, Ujuma. Mama, tell me. If I were the person in a position, will you tell me to let go? Or marry the father of my son? It is the past. He loves your sister so much, can't you see? Amarachi. Here is my decision. If that man wants my son, Chinoso, then he will have to marry me. Period. Amarachi! Mama, that is my decision. Have you forgotten what you and Nujuma did to me in this house? You frustrated my life. I went to hell because I was carrying his child. And you're here telling me this. Mama, see, don't talk to me again. Don't talk to me. I will strangle you. My sister's pet red is getting worse day by day. I don't know what to do. Lord, please um, come. We can't promise you anything for now. We will have to ask you to go. Let us first put our house in order. <sighs> okay. We've heard what you said. But please, can I see my grandson before I leave? Uh, I'm sorry. He's still sleeping. When next you come, oh? Can you go? It's okay. My son and I do not need money from these people. Do the right thing. My dear, I am sorry about this. She has been like this for a long time. Biko, oh, thank you so much. One more. Who wouldn't? I understand. Anthony, please come. Excuse me. Please come to my head. Sister's pet red is getting worse.
You really think that I will marry you? Is that what you think? Is that your plan? I don't love you and I will never love you. Don't you get that? It's obvious you have nothing sensible to say. I do not love you either. I am doing you a favor here. I'm offering you marriage because of your son. Then you think of something more reasonable. Think of something else. Like I said before, I can start any business, I can do anything for you, but not marriage. Don't you have anything else to say? I'm sorry. This is the best I can come up with. It's either you take it or you leave it. The boy is on your course. 